In tough economic times, wildlife officials say they often see an increase in illegal hunting. But whoever opened fire this weekend did so with no intention of killing for food. King 5's environmental specialist Gary Chittam is just back from Aberdeen, where elk are being slaughtered and many are upset about it. This is perfect elk habitat. They love this kind of stuff. The private timberlands of Grays Harbor County provide elk a perfect mix of thick woods and open clear cuts. Investigators brought us here to show us what happened to a small herd that was feeding here over the weekend. Bald eagles and other scavengers scatter as we approach and see the first two carcasses of poached elk. There's two, then three, and then four and five. And so just one after the other uh, got mowed down and just shot and left them. This makes eight elk found poached over the last few days, but these five are different. Whoever shot these animals didn't want them for food or even trophies. This is thrill killing. This is just, you know, fun for them. Whoever it was picked a nice spot to do their shooting from, up high above the elk down there, and we're not talking about any feat of marksmanship here. They were only about 80 yards away. The elk were down in a row below them. It was like shooting fish in a barrel. The poachers killed four females and a calf, just left them there. Investigators say each of the cows was probably pregnant, and there may be more damage out there limping around. And there's a very strong likelihood that we have several other injured elk within that herd as well. This is the kind of senseless killing that makes agents and legitimate hunters blood boil. To see five dead elk go to waste in a clear cut, I'm sure does not sit well with them. Very serious. Uh, this is something I'm very passionate about because they, they took something from all of us, not just me being a game warden, um, from every hunter out there that goes out there to, to hunt for these. Um, they stole from them. Investigators conducted a full-blown investigation at the scene and have some good clues, but say they need the public's help on this one. And they're upping the normal reward from 500 to to $1,000 to whoever can help them catch the poachers. Near Aberdeen, Gary Chittam, King 5 News. Investigators believe the poachers shot the five elk Saturday night. They say in the other three recent cases, the poachers butchered the elk and took the meat.